Hello everyone, how are you all? I hope you all are fine. Today we are going to discuss our next topic of the chapter work energy and power. In the last uh, lecture we discussed about the work, the types of work, uh, negative, positive, zero work, uh, now what type of quantity it is, we discussed the unit of uh, work. Today we are going to talk about the next topic that is energy. Okay, so first of all what is energy? Uh, what is the what is the first thing that comes in your mind when we talk about energy um, the first thing what comes in your mind i i am asking you when the we talk about energy what is the first thing that comes in your mind you would be thinking about the different forms of energy solar energy water energy these Yes, this is, these are the different forms of energy. These are the forms of energy. What does the energy, first thing is, what does the energy does? What does energy does? Energy does because when you are eating, you gain energy and due to that, uh, with the help of that energy, what do you do? You do the work. So, an energy is the ability to do work. Theek hai? Energy kya hai? Ek ability hai. जिससे हम क्या कर सकते हैं काम कर सकते हैं इट इज द एबिलिटी टू टू डू वर्क एंड एज वेल एज द एनर्जी इज इक्वल टू द वर्क वर्क एंड एनर्जी दे आर इक्वल टू ईच अदर हाउ लेट्स टेक एन एग्जाम्पल सपोज यू आर हैविंग अ वहीकल ओके यू आर हैविंग अ वहीकल यू आर हैविंग अ बाइक और स्कूटर ओके सो इन दैट स्कूटर यू आर हैविंग ओनली वन लीटर ऑफ पेट्रोल and your the average of your bike is in 1 liter it can go 60 kilometers or 30 kilometers or 40 kilometers okay so what it will do the what the bike is going to do it is going to consume that 1 liter of petrol that is in form of energy it is going to consume that energy and he is going to do the work of moving from one place to another that is 40 kilometers and when the fuel will be over, when the energy will be over, he will not do the work. So what does it mean? The work done and the energy, they are equal to each other. That's why we say that uh, energy is the ability to do work. Kisi kaam karne ki, uh, ki shamta ko ab, uh, hum kya bolte hain? Energy bolte hain. Hai? So what, now what type of quantity the energy is? Okay. First of all, we'll write energy is the ability to do work. What is energy? We'll write the definition. Energy. Energy is the ability to do work. ये क्या है? काम करने की शम्ता है. And this energy is equal to the uh, work done ठीक है हमारी energy किसके बराबर होती है work done के बराबर होती है and uh, I told I give explain you how the, you are, there are many examples suppose if you are uh, you are eating one chapati so you can do the work according to that only if you are eating four chapati you will do the work according to that so uh, it depends uh, how much energy is being consumed and how much work is done now you will say I am uh, eating so much of food then also I am not doing anything okay but the work is continuously going on inside your body your matter uh, uh, parts of the body they are working continuously and they are consuming that energy in any form because process of respiration does not stops okay if the process of respiration stops then only the body is going to stop working okay so the energy is going to consume it is going to consume continuously and that energy consumed by you is consumed in the form of work and it reflects in the form of work okay now uh, if you talk about the what type of quantity it is uh, it is a scalar quantity or a vector quantity Ab dekho kya hai? we said that energy is equal to work now we studied in the previous video that work is a scalar quantity so energy will also be a scalar quantity energy kaisi quantity hogi scalar energy it is a scalar 
क्वांटिटी कैसी क्वांटिटी है स्केलर क्वांटिटी ओके देन नेक्स्ट इज द यूनिट व्हाट इज द यूनिट यूनिट ऑफ यूनिट ऑफ एनर्जी यूनिट ऑफ एनर्जी एनर्जी की यूनिट क्या होगी वर्क वर्क डन आई टोल यू वर्क डन इज इक्वल टू जू वर्क डन इज इक्वल टू एनर्जी सो वर्क ए वी डू इन द जूल्स वर्क इज डन इन द जूल यूनिट इज जूल सो सिमिलरली हेयर यूनिट ऑफ एनर्जी विल बी जूल ओके सो दिस इज योर एस आई यूनिट एस आई यूनिट और विल राइट हेयर एस आई यूनिट फॉर एनर्जी इज जूल नाउ विल डिफाइन वन जूल हेयर Uh, how will define the one joule? This is very important. Define. You can write like this only. Define one joule. हम one joule को define करते हैं. This these type of question are being uh, uh, these type of question is being asked. Uh, in two marks define one joule uh, one newton okay uh, i told you previously also if you are going to talk about the one joule one newton we simply needs to take the formula okay and we, right now we are not joule is the unit of work also so formula of work is work ka formula kya hai force into displacement okay so how the one joule we are going to uh, um define when one newton of force is applied on an object and it, and it displaces by 1 meter so we say the one joule of work is done or one joule of energy is consumed okay so we'll write here one joule when one newton of force is applied on a body and body this places by 1 meter okay 1 meter then we can say 1 जूल ऑफ जूल ऑफ वर्क इज डन और एनर्जी इज कंज्यूम्ड ओके सो दिस इज योर यूनिट एंड वन वी हैव डिफाइंड दिस थिंग नाउ नेक्स्ट थिंग आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट एज योर फॉर्म्स ऑफ एनर्जी and today we are going to take uh, different different forms we are having okay i am going to uh, tell you and then we'll discuss the further which is very important uh, this is the starting of your um, <coughs> mechanics okay this is starting part of your mechanics okay mechanics means movement where movement is involved okay now forms of energy forms of energy see first main form is your kinetic energy kinetic energy okay second is your potential energy potential energy and these two forms together we call mechanical mechanical एनर्जी इन दोनों को साथ में हम क्या बोलते हैं मैकेनिकल थर्ड वी कैन राइट विंड एनर्जी विंड एनर्जी फोर्थ यू कैन राइट सोलर सोलर एनर्जी फिफ्थ यू कैन राइट विंड वी हैव रिटर्न वाटर एंड these there are many different uh, so nuclear or nuclear is there then uh, heat light heat energy we can write fifth sixth heat 
देन लाइट सोलर वी हैव रिटर्न एंड देन साउंड इलेक्ट्रिकल एंड न्यूक्लियर साउंड इलेक्ट्रिकल इलेक्ट्रिकल नाइन ओके न्यूक्लियर एनर्जी यू कैन राइट एनर्जी 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 हेयर बाई योर सेल्फ ओके दीज आर द डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स ऑफ एनर्जी एंड इन दिस क्लास योर नाइन्थ क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द मैकेनिकल एनर्जी फॉर्म टू फॉर्म्स दैट इज योर काइनेटिक एनर्जी वील स्टडी मोर डीपली अबाउट काइनेटिक एनर्जी एंड पोटेंशियल एनर्जी इन दिस क्लास नाउ we'll study this further let we are because we are not going to study these more deeper so i am going to discuss a few few, few parts about this what are the wind energy see wind wind energy is an energy which is generated with the flow of wind theek hai wind mills jo hoti hain wo aapki wind energy pe chalti hain theek hai so wind energy it is that form solar energy is your sun sun the heat energy also you can say light energy also you can say this this form solar energy okay then water water is your tidal okay uh, tidal energy and your hydro power plant and the river the energy given by the rivers and these these are this comes in the water energy then heat energy heat is uh, given by your uh, it, it is in the tidal form also in this oceans also heat the energy produced with the help of heat that is your fuels and your uh, any kind of fuel it can be petrol diesel coal anything okay then sound energy the energy produced with the help of uh, sound that is a sound sound energy then electrical energy that you can see the light fan uh, your all the electronic devices they work on the electrical energy this is also one of the form and then last is the nuclear this is very uh, important uh, or we can say Uh, very essential and very advanced uh, form of energy that is a nuclear energy and we are having the nuclear power plant in our country uh, which generates electricity with the help of the nuclear energy okay now these were the different different forms of uh, uh, energy we are going to discuss today the kinetic energy okay we'll discuss a little bit about um, we are not going to uh, uh, do all the things whatever it is included in kinetic energy i am going to just discuss about the kinetic energy what is kinetic energy let's rest things the math, the theory part uh, we'll discuss in the next lecture okay now uh, uh, first of all see kinetic energy kinetic word is uh, derived from the word movement kinetic ka matlab kya hota hai movement okay so kinetic energy the energy which is generated due to movement or motion okay kinetic ka matlab hota hai movement okay so the energy which is being generated uh, from the movement of the body that energy is known uh, as the kinetic energy us energy ko hum kya bolenge kinetic energy suppose i am moving right now my hand what i am i am doing i am moving my hand and i am changing this velocity of my hand so the energy uh, due to uh, the velocity of the hand the velocity of the hand the energy possessed by my hand right now due to the change in the velocity that will be your kinetic energy the movement of the buses the bus is moving with certain velocity the will so that time the energy which will be possessed by the body that will be in the form of kinetic energy hamari body ke andar energy continuously do parts mein transfer hoti rehti hai theek hai wo kinetic se potential mein jaati hai potential se kinetic mein change hoti hai so kinetic energy is energy which is possessed due to the वेलोसिटी और द मूवमेंट ऑफ द ऑब्जेक्ट ठीक है जब उसके मूवमेंट से जो एनर्जी पजेस करेगी बॉडी तो दैट एनर्जी विल बी नोन एज कानेटिक एनर्जी और जो उसके रेस के उससे पजेस करती है तो उसे हम क्या बोलते हैं पोटेंशियल एनर्जी सो राइट नाउ सपोज दिस मार्कर इज मूविंग सो एंड इट हैज केम टू रेस वेन इट वॉज मूविंग इट दैट टाइम इट वॉज हैविंग कानेटिक एनर्जी बिकॉज इट इज 
it was having some certain velocity when it came to rest on my palm when it came to rest on my palm it is at rest means the velocity is zero and right now it is having the potential energy because it is having a certain height and the gravitational force is acting on this body okay so uh, the two forms of energy that is very important the kinetic energy and potential energy go through your ncrt book today we'll discuss rest thing in your next lecture uh, we'll go deep about uh, we'll study more deeper about the kinetic energy and potential energy and we'll do the mathematical forms of these energy in the next lecture till then you go through your ncrt book prepare your notes whatever i have written on the board write down in your fair notebook and then we'll meet in the next lecture thank you